Hello guys, uh, welcome back. In this video, I am going to tell you how to do a testing of sensors for pump room gas system. This is from the maker of Omicron. So we have total six location which is covered. So we'll see in this video. So stay tuned in this video to see how we are going to test in pump room all the sensors, different sensors, and how we receive the alarms. So guys, on top is your gas system for ballast tank which i have already shown you uh, how it works and how to solve a small small problem which you face on this system and the bottom side you know this is omicron gas cabinet for pump room system so we have six different locations you can see here in pump room and we have this you can see hydrocarbon 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 and h2s 2 and one oxygen so total three hydrocarbon two h2s sensor and one oxygen so one by one we'll test all and we'll see how we receive alarm here i just want to show you what is there inside let's see what is there inside so inside you can see six pcbs are there which are connected for each sensor and here we have some fuses this one is power supply which gives you 220 and 24 these are the bridges so here are some push buttons some push buttons are there inside you can see here which you can do it for adjustment I'm not going to touch it now if required I will show you because unnecessarily you should not touch it so you can see here hydrocarbon low alarm is for 10 percent high is 30 percent h2s low is 5 ppm high is 10 ppm o2 19.5 low alarm and low low is 17.5 so we go to pump room and check all these location how the sensor looks uh, before going to pump room i will show you uh, the spare sensors which i have in ccr For testing hydrocarbon, I have used this isobutane, which is 0.9%, 50% LEL. So for and to carry out oxygen and H2S sensor, I have used this bottle. You can see H2S 25 ppm and nitrogen 99.99%. So with nitrogen you can test your oxygen and H2S with H2S sensor. So this is my pump room. I will go bottom and I will see the sensors. They are at different floor. One is at that floor. Two sensors are there. One is hydrocarbon and one is H2S. So two sensors are over there in the second one. And the bottom one on top we have oxygen and three at individual COP so total six sensors are there so I will go down and I will show you I have to change this sensor so so one of the sensor I need to change so I will take this sensor and I have to change for that location so I will go there and I will change it
this is the sensor which I need to change hydrocarbon one this one is S2S so I'll open this and I will change it I have removed the old one this is the new one I will give the connection to that plug which is over here and then I will switch it on uh, I have given the connection this red white and black the sensor is over here switch on fifty hundred now you can you can see all the readings is showing exactly same as the old one okay doing a sensor checker So guys, uh, you have seen, when you change it, you will have to do sub setting, which you can do from down, we have buttons up, down and ok, so with the help of that you can change the reading and uh, you can make it to the required one. So like this you are going to test and change your sensors for pump room gas system. Hope you like the video. See you in the next video. Till then, bye-bye. Take care.